come to the media. Uh, thank you very much. Give yeah, us your impression. We lost 1 0 today. Yeah, I think uh, uh, in terms of uh, position, we played very well, especially in the, the first 45 minutes. And uh, we have a couple of chances uh, to be capitalizing. I think uh, we are bad luck today, but I'm really uh, impressed about the performance. I'm, uh, I'm disappointed on the results, but uh, for the performance, at least, uh, we are seeing uh, players are playing the possession football you know, as it should be. Was Oilers uh, a better team today? Uh, not actually. Um, uh, they don't like a better team to us uh, today. Yes, one can call them a better uh, team because they, they won. Uh, but otherwise, I think uh, we played better in the, in the, in the whole night. So far, the statistics available to you, who created more chances? Uh, I think uh, we created uh, more chances uh, in the first 45 minutes. Uh, in the second 45 minutes, they have a couple of chances uh, uh, to uh, uh, our mistakes, um, which is uh, counter attacks. They have uh, a couple of uh, chances in the second half. But uh, I think uh, we created more chances uh, in, the, in, the, in the 90 minutes than them. You think you should have better water penalty today? <laughs> anyway, that's a uh, referee's decision. Um, I don't want to. In my opinion, it's a uh, handball, but maybe in the uh, referee's opinion, it is not handball. And uh, he's the man in charge. Um, he has a final say. Um, but I think um, uh, we do make mistakes. If we have a mistake, we have to accept it. Papa, before the at the end of the Super Cup, you did say that the title race is between this time and the DWAC. Here you are. Uh, take team on a uh, 12 on the table, uh, but somewhere 10 in the probably in the relegation zone with the statistics. Wait, do you want to change your comments about the title race being between this guy and BYC? Uh, not actually. Um, the, uh, the race is too young. We just play two games out of uh, 22 games. Uh, you can't just, just say now we are not part of the title race. Already, um, uh, uh, the title leader might be a seven, seven points or eight points, and uh, we have three points. So it's just a matter of uh, two games. Uh, uh, nothing has done yet. So you still maintain that it's a two horse race? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yes, I have that belief. But other coaches think that you are being disrespectful. Sorry for my choice of words. They think you are being disrespectful to them that it's a title race between this guy and who has it. Uh, well, it's their own opinion and I'm uh, entitled to my opinion to say um, one time uh, one of the coaches said that I didn't bring any new thing in Liberia. Yeah, that's the broadest uh, coach. And uh, that is his opinion. I respect it. Um, uh, my own, also my uh, opinion uh, wants to respect it. That's what I believe. So, so Tafa, I want to know, um, you talked about Christopher Jackson incorporating a form of to you and you have a full run as you said, one full run as you. How do you make a performance to this one? Yeah, I think uh, today is uh, a little bit, uh, when you look at his performance today, it's not very up to standard as we know Chris. Uh, but those type of things we need to accept it. It is our role as a coach uh, to make sure we work with the players, help the players, prepare the players for the game. So whatever he does in the field of play, uh, we should be responsible. So, so thank you for the at the end of the first phase, if you are not in the top three, should you be dismissed or will you resign? Um, uh, uh, for me, I don't believe um, uh, to be dismissed. Uh, as coaches, when you do, when you know you are not doing what you're supposed to do, you should resign ceremonies. That's what I believe. Thank you so much. Thank you too.